Up, oh, up. Oh, hang on. What's happening here? Oh no! Oh no! 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 Oh no! This is a huge disaster because they're all on passive. Oh no! Oh no! Everybody to Swampy's Hut. I'm your humble host, Swamp Donkey here. Come gather around the fire, get your grub ready. We got a lot to do today. I've done some off work camera and we've tamed up some new dinosaurs and we can get those introduced. And then I want to experiment with some taming and untaming. Okay. Oh man. Well, this is a little unexpected, but here's all the new dinosaurs, folks. <laughs> All right, we're going to, let's see, what are you, what level are you, 16? Hmm, can I? Oh, man, this would be an excellent tame right here. Here we go. We're going to try this and see. Oh, let's draw it back right in the head. Boom, got her. Did I? No. What? <laughs> what kind of odds? Is, what's the odds of that? Okay, right in the back of the head on that one. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. I was able to tame a few more dinosaurs, and I lost some in the process because... Oh man, Sasha, Sasha, Sasha. Just that's your just introduction to every video is you drop a deuce uh, right here in front of everybody. Uh, but you know what? I appreciate those deuces because eventually I'm gonna have a humongous farm going, and they're gonna be needed. So I'd like to introduce you to Expo because uh, he's pretty fast, um, and he's gonna be kind of my guinea pig today for air. Uh, experiment and like if I unclaim him because when I tamed him he was level 4 now he's level 5 which let's go ahead and uh, up his health real quick oh man you're almost out of meat buddy and then we got uh, get over here because he's a scorpion get it he's a scorpion you know get over here anybody here I'll, I'm sure I'll have a little uh, sound bite or something there for you to be like oh okay that makes sense yeah yeah, yeah you're like um, and then finally we got Reptar. Yeah, anybody? Anybody knows who Reptar is? Here. Bam. There, that was Reptar. Um, <laughs> that'll look pretty dumb if I can't uh, figure out how to get that on the screen. <laughs> so anyways, these guys are really cool. I got super lucky with this dude. Uh, he was like 60-something, 70-something, and I tamed him up. And, uh, almost didn't happen because, uh, because I didn't have any spoiled meat on me, and I had to like split my stacks up into one to get them to to end as fast as possible. Robin of Loxley, yeah, yeah. Nope, can't. Okay, what if you do that? Let's see. Do you, no. Kind of a kind of a fuck it. Close up there. All right. So, anyways, uh, because of all that work I've done and taming I've done, I've gotten a few levels myself. So we're just gonna quickly level up a couple of things here. I think I've decided to go ahead and level up uh, the weight a little bit. Go ahead and level up these dinos that you just got introduced to. And then I'm going to get set up and we're going to start experimenting with this little guy. So let's go ahead and level them up uh, really quick. I kind of want you to be a mule, but you know, uh, Sasha, what what do you have to say to me? <laughs> you're not going to be that great of a mule. I hate to tell you. I'm sorry, but you're level 11. But you're the first tame I ever have, so I'm bound and determined to keep you, keep you, girl. You, uh, let's see, leveled you already. And, uh, hmm. What do you think, guys? I mean, uh, this scorpion is fast, uh, especially swimming. Holy cow! They can swim like crazy. Uh, he's already got a pretty decent amount of health. I'm thinking, I'm thinking melee damage, maybe? Um, because they can think they can help you tame I don't know just more experiment more stuff to do in the future and movement speed and then this guy absolutely nothing but uh, movement speed and melee damage because they are awesome and uh, later on uh, maybe not as useful sorry you didn't hear me say that sorry I'm sorry I'm so sorry but uh, for, for right now having a decent level uh, reptar especially at my level uh, what am I? 30? I'm already 30. I know you're thinking, like, good God, man, you're at episode 4 and you're level 30? But, 
uh, it'll slow down quite a bit, and I've done several hours of off-camera play as well. So let's see. Hmm. Yeah, this one's kind of hard. I think health. I think we're gonna have to do some health here, cause, cause I need you to stay alive longer, buddy. So, all right. Well, I'm gonna get set up here. I'm probably gonna go ahead and build some saddles uh, for these guys off-camera. Oh my goodness, Sasha! Like. Like you, you got two deuces to, and, and every, and no one else has any. Get, can I deuce? Let's see. Can I deuce? Am I deuce in here? Let's see. Oh! Ha! <laughs> ha! You're not the only one who can deuce around here. I can deuce too. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm gonna get ready to start experimenting with the uh, expo here. All right. Welcome back, folks. And here we are. I got uh, everything repaired. Did a little uh, berry collecting. Got some narcotics brewing up in the petal and morstel. <laughs> I just really messed that up. <laughs> Pestle and mortal, <laughs> I believe. Anyway, so I got uh, Expo here. And I remember why they named him Expo. Because it's for experiments. And he is away from everyone else. I got all of them on passive. I got him on passive. So we're going to unclaim him. Let's see. And, wow, you got to really want to do this. Okay. And then, what happens? So, he's... he's hey, oh, okay. So, you just... So, he's he's kind of in limbo. He's kind of like, you can't... I can't tame him again. What happens if I hit him? Does he attack me? Oh, uh, yeah. The music's playing. No, he, he's not. He's... You just hit E? And now he's mine again. Okay, so, uh, yeah. I guess that could have been, like, a... That could have been a bad <laughs> abuse in the game where you can just claim and retame and claim and retame and unclaim and then retame and so forth and so on. Um, until your dino was level, you know, whatever. Whatever you felt like. Or maxing out. I guess there's, uh, there's like a max or something. Okay, cool. So... I got uh, enough materials here for some saddles, so I figured we'd whip up a couple of saddles here. We got a Reptor saddle. A Reptor. That's what I'm... They're just going to get called Reptars from now on. Ooh, if I can make the this helmet, I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to go ahead and do that too while I'm at. And then we got the Trike saddle here. And I'm trying to save up some points. I'm still saving up my, uh, my Ingrams here. Because you never know when you're going to need them. And... Kind of look like an old football player. <laughs> but uh, let's see. We got the trike saddle. We're going to put him on. Nope. Oh, that's right. You can't. You just have to. You just have to kind of. You put it in their inventory. And then. You don't grab the stem berries. You grab the saddle. And voila! There you go. Saddled up. It's a little dark. Let's, uh, let's raise it up here. What are you? You're female. Yeah, her. If I get on her. I mean, raptors just kind of look like girls, don't they? Maybe with the wild hair and the and the wings, the kind of you know feminine, if you say so. Not 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 being sexist. Don't want to get in trouble here, but uh, but we're gonna ride. It's our first time riding a dinosaur. Woo! Yeah. Let's see if we can get a better. Can we get a better? Yeah. Show off, girl. Show them what you got. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm no circus lion. <laughs> I can chase them, but I can't chase this one over water. It's the same one. <laughs> Look, I'm gonna try to try to light it up a couple more times. Let's see. All right, we're gonna we're gonna see if I can put uh, put Reptar to use here. Okay, so all right. Hopefully, we don't get murderized here. Alright guys, I'm going to chase this thing down and see if we can get it tamed. Alright, well, no luck really guys, but uh, we did discover... Where's that metal rock at? I wanted to kind of show you guys, like, what happens uh, with a cool metal rock. Uh, aha! Here we are. So I'm going to get off here and see, see if I can mine this thing and see how much metal... See if it gives us, like, more metal than normal. Yeah, look at this. I'm getting a lot of stone, and I thought, was it, I thought with this you got, oh, 
I guess you only get stone from these kind of rocks. You don't get flint. And uh, I obviously have uh, way too much, so we're going to drop all that. And I might still be too heavy for her to carry me. Okay, well, I didn't get the bird, fellas, so I'm going to go back to the house. And uh, let's see. What else? What else did I want to do today? Yeah, we can we can mess around with the trike for a little bit, show you how they harvest, and maybe try to search out and find some new dinos to tame. Okay, so the very second I leave you, here it is. Here's the the stupid thing. And at this point, I don't even know if it's worth it anymore. So <laughs> let's go back to the hut and get settled. All right, we're back, everybody, and uh, I got Sasha here. And I just wanted to kind of show y'all what she's all about. And Sasha is a harvester. And a mighty fine one at that. Golly, look at all this. Boom. She hits several bushes at once. And I don't know, but I think she gets a bonus. Like, she will harvest more from the same bush uh, than I would myself. And that's all you do. I think she can harvest trees as well. Although, oh, she's out of stamina. Pretty fast. Good God, that's bright. Oof. Sorry about that, everybody. I'm just going to kind of hide <laughs> behind the rock here. And then uh, you can press uh, F while you're on the saddle. And you can see what all they've harvested. And just that little bit of time, we got 190 narco berries. And those are the most, uh, or one of the more rare berries to get. But we got a lot of good seeds. Uh, all kinds of good stuff, just just for that little bit of time. So, having your dinosaurs, using your dinosaurs. Uh, good lord, I, I need to research how to do this. Uh, hang on, I'll be right back, and then uh, we're gonna all learn together. All right, guys, we're back, and up, oh, up. Oh, hang on, what's happening here? Oh no, oh no, 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 oh no, this is a huge disaster because they're all on passive. Oh no, oh no. <laughs> Oh no. Oh, this is a huge disaster. Oh man. Kill him. Come on. Oh god. Oh man. Oh man. Okay, okay. Woo. Okay. He killed Expo. Okay, well, uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, how do we get rid of all this uh, brightness here? You hit gamma r dot bloom quality, I think. Let's look. Yep, quality, and then space zero enter. Okay, that lowered some. Now we're gonna do it again. R dot light shades space zero enter and did that did that did that did that do it oh is that is that the right thing light shafts oh <laughs> well hmm don't get your shade mixed up with your shafts fellas let's see light shafts zero enter and no it's still kind of the same oh they're not coming through the not coming through the trees anymore though. I can't play any more, uh, you know, sappy ass music and, and whatever. <laughs> okay, so uh, that was kind of it when it comes to what the trike's all about. Uh, I think the next thing I want to do is kind of explore a little bit with Reptar. Maybe we can find and tame a new dinosaur, bring him back to the base, and maybe get a little more protection over here. All right, real quickly, everybody, I just leveled up, so I figured we could uh, level up together. And I think I'm just going to keep pumping uh, some movement speed for the next little while. And that makes me level 31. So, hmm. We really do need to think about base protection. So I think what we're going to do is learn the wooden fence, Ingram. And... Hmm, what else? Dinosaur gateway with the gate. Definitely need to learn that. I really need to go ahead and learn the preserving bin. Uh, I 
do I want to? I think I'm gonna skip those for now if I can't. Let's see, what do I need? I, oh, I have to learn the stone one for that. Mm, that's a bummer. Okay. All right. Well, I'm gonna figure this out uh, probably off camera, and we'll we'll get to it together. So, anyways, just wanted to level up with you guys. We'll be right back with you. All right, we're back, folks, and uh, that drops back. And I just, I can't resist. I have to go after it. Now that I got a, a Reptar with me, we're going after it. Okay, everybody. Shh, shh, hush. We're back, and we're here at uh, maybe our second or third drop we've gotten ever. Uh, you know. <laughs> Blah, boo. Uh, you can keep all that. I guess I'll break it just so you can see, like, what it looks like. It's not cool, cool uh, glass everywhere, but uh, eh, no real luck. However, however, let's drop all this malarkey. You can just uh, highlight one thing and press O and just hold O and and it's gone. However, though, down here, oh boy, that guy's toast. I've never tamed one of these head butter things, and man, they are tough. Uh, I tried one time, and I got my butt kicked. So we're going to go down here because I saw... Oh, there's a... There's a poop factory! Yeah, I need one of, I'll need one of you later on, but not right now. Uh, sorry, sorry. Um, there's a stego. Where do you go? Right here. Okay. So we are going to try to tame... Uh, this stego here. I figured we could do it together. How exciting is that? So, alright, let's get off. And I have you set to passive. Um, oh man, I think he'll be okay. I'm ju I'll just be right here. I'll be right around the corner. And I have you not following me. So, let's see. What level is this stego? Uh, 13. That shouldn't be hard. That should not be too hard at all to tame. So we're going to blast it. Uh, let's see. Right in the head. Boom! Got him! Ha! Got him! Uh, okay. How about right in the butt? <laughs> oh, man. Uh, they're running. No? Is it running? No. Oh, shit. It ain't running. Here it comes. Duck and weep. Oh, boy. That, oh, good. God, that hurt. Yeah, yeah, come on, get it. Oh, right in the face. <laughs> Duck and weave. You got a kite, ladies and gentlemen. You got a kite. And bam. Come on. Ooh, I thought for sure you'd be out by now. You're not really hurting me too bad. And your turning radius sucks. So. Uh, you must be getting close to taming or dying or falling out because you're running. Is that it? Did we do it? Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! We did it. Alright, I'm going to get some, uh, let's see, we got narco here. Narcotic, I call it narco. And we're going to tame this bad boy. Alright guys, I'm going to go get Reptar. Did you just eat? You did eat. Oh man, ooh, this is going to be a little bit of a taming process. Alright, I'm going to go get Reptar everybody. And then we'll uh, we'll be back when uh, Stego here is uh, about tamed up. It's, they're totally different. <laughs> That's great! He just kind of like pops his head up. He's like, oh, I'm here. I'm eating. Don't mind me, guys. I'm just eating. Oh, that's him. That's totally the Stego voice. I'm Stego. I'm Steggy the Stegosaurus. I will... Oh, okay, great. Well, he's got one more feed to go. And we got into a little fight over here. <laughs> All three of us. We had a big talk. And come on. Here it goes. Here it goes. Yes, we did it. Nice. They always have, like, the coolest colors on the dossiers. And we got nothing. Nada. The, uh, not to say you're not cool. Co okay, we'll call you <laughs> cool colors. <laughs> Well, you know what? We'll just call you CC for cool colors, but that way it's, it's not as lame. It's just, you know, C, C. Okay, all right, cool. So, let's head back over to the base, guys. Okay, well, uh, absolute disaster. Uh, there he is. 
dead. Didn't even make it halfway across the water. <sighs> so, uh, yeah, uh, golly, that's uh, pretty frustrating after all that same time. Um, I probably should have cleared the water out uh, a little better. Uh, in fact, didn't clear it out whatsoever. So, lesson learned there, Swampy. All right, guys, we're back, and I saw this uh, green spawn, uh, green drop happen. So, we're uh, running over here with uh, Reptar, and we're going to see if we can get it. Come on, we got to get over there before it despawns. I'm so far from from the from the hut. You, it, it always seems so close until you start going after it. You're like, oh, I can see where it is, and then when you start going after it, you're like, okay, I'm a million miles from the from the hut. So, come on, come on, come on, come on. We can do it. We can do it. I I have confidence. We can do it. We can do it. We're here. There's a dodo. We're here. We're here. Don't don't despawn, please don't. Please don't. All right, we're running. We're running. We're running. Yes. All right, we're just gonna take it real quick. Let's see what all we got. We got a uh, mortar and pestle, uh, paintbrush. That's cool. So I don't have to learn that. And a parasaur saddle. So I don't have to learn that either. Nice. Yeah, that's cool. And a large box. Alright guys, uh, we're back, and after that fail with the Stego, I've decided that I've got to tame something. we got to get something done this video, and we're going to need a lot of these turtles later on for their eggs as well. So, I figured we could go ahead and tame this turtle up real quick. Right in the neck. <laughs> Come on. Boom! And that is it. Down for the count. Nice. Alright guys, we're going to get this uh, dino tamed up and back over to the hut. Holy cow, folks. Uh, we just knocked out this pterodactyl, uh, pterodon, with uh, one arrow. Nice. So, now we're going to be to dual taming the pterodon and the turtle. <laughs> I'm going to have to go get some more berries, so... All right, guys, we'll cut back when we're back at the house. Bruh. That's right, everybody. You saw me die, but I didn't go out without a fight. Look at that. Yep, still got my uh, staff or spear in my hand. All weird. What? It looks like... Oh, it's my foot. Oh. <laughs> so we got everyone tamed up here. Uh, Pterodon came out at 13. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We're going to change the name to, hmm, I, I, I really, I really like it, uh, it's going to be Thomas, Thomas the Pterodactyl, the Pterodactyl, or the, I'm sorry, the Pterodon, <laughs> oh god, <laughs> the first deuce, it, it, I would say it's cute, but uh, that's pretty gross, Thomas, okay, it, it's just seriously gross. So, all right, guys, we're gonna try to get back <laughs> over to the hut, and we'll we'll be right back with you. All right, guys, so big fails today, big fails. Uh, I lost first. I lost CC, then we went to the drop, and I tamed a turtle and a pterodon, which you saw, and I lost them both uh, on the way back. It's just been it's been rough. It's been a rough day. <laughs> But I got a little higher level of a Stego here, which is what we started with. And uh, I'm thinking it's going to be level 35 when it's done. And it's a harvester, just like the trike, but it should be able to carry a lot more. So I'm going to see if I can hunt down something else to tame at the same time. And uh, so we can actually get some new dinos. Like the title says. <laughs> Alright guys, we're back and I got a level uh, 51 turtle here. A new Shelly. A new Shelly. And a new stego. So, once I get this guy knocked out, you know, kind of check your surroundings. Make sure you're not about to get ambushed. Oh, and he's out. Oh, I missed it. Well, dang. Okay. Anyways, I'm going to tame this guy up as well. And we'll be back at you when we get back to the base. Hopefully this time, for the love of God. Jesus. All right. Welcome, welcome back, guys. We got our uh, stego here. Uh, got into a little bit of a skirmish with... Where are you? Annoying you, this guy. He's level 99 now, but he was like 60-something when we fought. And I 
decided instead of killing him, we're just going to tame him. And he can fight for me from now on instead of me constantly having to fight for these guys. Jeez! So we got a level 31 uh, Stego. That's cool. Cool. Not bad. Uh, I'm up to level 32 now. <laughs> I guess it's just all the fighting I've had to do. Uh, got some Ingram points built back up. And uh, let's check out this guy's stats real quick. Let's see. We got uh, 1,100 health. Uh, some nice weight. Uh, at my level, 475, not bad. Um, and yeah, who knows about all that? He's probably slow. Um, so let's see, they're both following me. So when the heat tames up, we'll get uh, Shelly here, and we'll get them both back over to the base. I swear we're going to do it this time. I promise. And we'll be back at you, folks. All right, all right, everybody. All right, tempers down, tempers down. Oh, y'all should have seen it. As soon as these guys walked up, these guys bolted over and was like, Hey, what are you guys doing over here? Weren't you, Reptar? Weren't you, cute little Reptar? Uh, anyways, uh, okay, so new guys, Shelly, CC, and annoying. <laughs> I do like your color, though. You're pretty sweet color. I'd like y'all to meet the OGs, the get over here. Uh, Sasha from Russia. She's Sasha from Russia. Oh, she's also a professor of uh, brutality and then uh reptar so you guys mingle have some fun get to get to know each other we're all a big happy family now we all made it we all survived <laughs> we made it back over here so all right uh yeah so thank you guys so much for watching uh it was a lot of fun today we laughed we cried i cried some more off camera um, <laughs> but as always, I had a great time playing ARK, uh, hanging with you guys. I hope you guys had some fun hanging out today. If you had fun, please don't hesitate. Bam that like button. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe because we're going to keep having fun. We're going to keep building, keep growing, keep finding new dinosaurs. And who knows what the future holds. Thank you guys so much and y'all have a great day.